Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you very much for joining me for another video. So today's video is actually going to be a Topshop sale haul. Now I ordered this last week and I did pay for next day delivery for it to arrive ASAP so I could get the video up for you guys to be able to shop the offer. Unfortunately the items haven't come until today which is about a week later and the offer ended last night which is such a heartbreak um, but these items are still available if you do want to shop any of them obviously they just won't be discounted in any way other than if you have a student discount card then they do have 20% off for students at the moment so a few of you might be able to make use of that so when I was shopping for these pieces I did originally plan to get five but then I ended up with seven so I was hoping to call this video five top picks from the top shop sale um, but I suppose that seven top picks from the top shop sale doesn't really have the same ring so I'm just going to call it a top shop sale haul so before I get into the video, I would love it if you could subscribe and don't forget to turn the notification bell on. This week I'm hoping to do a review of Loving Tan and then on Sunday I will be posting a video styling up all of these pieces and showing you how I would wear them and what they look like on. So yeah, make sure to do that so you don't miss them. And of course, if you don't already, I would love for you to follow me on Instagram. My handle is at the underscore fashion dot blogger. I will pop that on the screen somewhere so you can see it. I will also link it below. But other than that, I think we will jump straight on into the haul. So this is the first item that I picked up. Probably doesn't look as good on the hanger as what I'm hoping it will look on. Um, but it's just this really pretty little top. Now this is super affordable. It's $14.99 and I just thought, what a steal. So when I saw this on the website, I was expecting it to be sheared like this all the way around. But actually on the back, it's just like a simple jersey style. So hence the slightly cheaper price. I did think that was too good to be true to have the sheared detail all the way around. But still, that's not a complaint. I still think it's absolutely beautiful. And I absolutely love the sleeves. I think this kind of thicker band here makes it look that bit more expensive, which is another reason probably why I was a bit confused as to why it was so cheap. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to throw this on with some jeans and some shorts, see what it looks like. So I opted for a size 10, so I'm hoping that it fits. Although I don't want it to be too big, but equally I don't like tops like this to be too tight either. Um, so I'm hoping that it fits just right. And yeah, I just think it's a really nice spring summer piece and I think the colour is absolutely gorgeous. And the next item is something that I actually already own in white. If you do follow me on Instagram, you will know that I have this shirt in the white colour and I go on about it all the time. It's literally a proper wardrobe staple of mine. I would actually say it's in the top three items of my wardrobe. That's how much I love it. So I thought I had to pick it up in another colour. So I went for this classic kind of striped colour. This is just perfect for spring and I just think it's going to look gorgeous with a pair of denim shorts or jeans and it's just going to be added into my kind of go-to classic pieces. However, I feel as though this one is thinner than my other one, but I can't do a comparison here because I've stupidly left the white one at my boyfriend's. I will insert a picture on the screen of me wearing it so you can see which one I'm talking about. Um, but this just feels thinner, but don't take my word for it because I don't know if it is. Um, but if anybody else has this and has the white one, let me know if you think that because I could just be going crazy. So this one is... £25 full price and in the sale I do believe it was £20. I will make sure to leave all of the sale prices on the screen just in case any of you were curious. Um, but the thing that I love about these shirts the most is the little scalloped edge. I don't know if you can see on the camera but hopefully you'll be able to see in the picture that I've just put on. Um, I just think it gives it such a nice little detail and just makes it look that bit more kind of different, a bit more expensive. And yeah, I just absolutely love them. I could rave on about these shirts forever. If you're looking for an oversized shirt, then definitely try them. Um, yeah, as I said, I have the white one and it's absolutely beautiful. Also, I thought I would just mention, I've gone for this one in a size eight because I tried on the 10 and an eight in the store when I originally brought the white one and the 10 was just huge on me. So I'm normally between an eight and a 10. And to be honest with tops, I do normally go for a 10 just so they're a bit more comfy. I don't like my clothes to be really snug. So if you are in between two sizes, I would probably go for the smaller one of the two, just because they do come up quite big. I'm hoping that's the same for this one, but as I said, the white one is definitely a very oversized style. So 
do just bear that in mind. Although I do find that because I went for my smaller size out of the two, the cuffs can be quite tight, but I was kind of happy to have that and the shirt not look really big on me, if that makes sense. Um, so yeah, I would probably say to go for the smaller size out of the two, unless you do want it to be really oversized. Then the next item I got was this sweatshirt. I just think this is like so visually appealing. I know it's really simple, but there's just something about it that I really like. I think the butterfly detail here is really nice and I'm not actually entirely sure what this writing means or says, so um, I should probably research that. But yeah, I just think it's a really nice piece to have in my wardrobe. I actually really love wearing sweatshirts at the moment. They're just so easy and comfy to throw on. However, this will be nice around the house, but I totally see myself wearing this one out as well with like shorts or something in the spring. And yeah, I just really like it. There's not much to say about it. It's just a nice sweatshirt, but I just think it's going to be a really nice piece to slot into my wardrobe. So I got this one in a size medium. I'm hoping it's not too big, but I do like to size up in this kind of thing, just so it's not like fitted. You just get that more kind of looser, slightly more expensive look. And um, this one is £25 at full price. And then the next item I got was this really pretty play suit. Now I can't say I was particularly shopping for something like this because obviously we're not really going out at the moment and I just wanted some nice kind of tops and easy things to wear. But I saw this on the model and I just thought it looked so, so beautiful and just really expensive and really beautifully designed. So the price is £35 originally. So I really don't think that's that bad for a piece that's this pretty and this beautifully done. So as you can see, it has these really gorgeous spaghetti straps. And then on the back, as you can see, it just has this really nice cutout detail here. Again, with this kind of spaghetti style tie detail here. And then on the sleeves, you can see we've just got these really nice little ruffles here. And then it almost has this kind of layered effect, which I think is really nice. I just thought this was a really gorgeous piece and I wanted to give it a try. I also love that it has a waist belt. I like to be able to cinch things in. I just think it makes them look a bit more nicer and just kind of helps it fit your body shape a bit better. So yeah, I actually got this one in a size 10. I'm hoping it's not too big, but there's nothing worse than buying a play suit that's too small. It's just, yeah, not nice. Um, so yeah, fingers crossed it fits. If not, I have to change it, but I really hope this looks as nice as I think it will. <laughs> then I picked up this really gorgeous kind of cardigan jumper style top. I've seen so many people wearing these at the moment and kind of lounging around the house in them. And I thought I would have to pick one up and give it a try. I think this will just look so nice with denim shorts. I think it's going to be such a gorgeous contrast. And I love pieces like this for spring and summer because you can actually wear them and not be cold. I often see things like this around autumn and winter and I'm like, that's so nice, but there's no way that's going to keep me warm because as you can see, the knit of it is just so open, but obviously perfect for spring. Um, but yeah, I just try to avoid things like this through autumn, winter for that reason. So I think spring is the perfect time to get your hands on this kind of top. So I got this in a size medium, I wanted it to be oversized, I wanted it to be slouchy and comfy and the original price for this one is £29. Then next up I have another pretty little top, so I've actually left this one on the hanger because it's probably the best way to show you. So as you can see, again it's just this nice kind of sheared effect, I seem to be loving that at the moment, I don't know why, but everything I kind of go towards has that. So it has it around the front and obviously it does continue around to the back. And then it also has it on the sleeves, so I'm hoping that makes this fit nice and puffy and pretty. And then it does also have this really nice kind of, what's that class does? My mind's totally gone blank as to what you would call this kind of detail. Kind of like a folded pleated effect. Um, and then on the back, similar to the um, to the playsuit actually, it has this kind of open detail with the little tie. So I just thought that was a really nice, pretty piece. There's not much to say about it. It's just a pretty simple white top that you can kind of throw on and just wear. Um, so yeah, I also think it will look beautiful with a tan, which I still need to get. I'm really hoping that the tan I've ordered from Loving Tan works wonders. So we're gonna have to see how that goes. Then lastly is a piece that honestly I would never normally go for and it's this pink cropped jumper. So given the fact we're all at home at the moment, I wanted to give this a try. I just think it's such a cool kind of at home vibe. 
Equally, when we're allowed out again, I think it'll be a nice comfy piece to wear to my boyfriends, like on the weekend. Um, but I just don't know how it's going to look on me. I'm not the coolest of people. Um, and I personally feel as though this is quite a cool piece. But we'll have to see, see how it goes, maybe with some flares or some like trackies. I don't know. I'll have to try and um, see what it looks like on Sunday's video. Um, but yeah, there's just something about it I was drawn to. <laughs> I don't know why. Maybe it was the pink. So I got this one in a size medium. I was hoping that the bigger I go, the kind of longer and slouchier it is. I didn't want this to be like super tight and super cropped. I'm too old for that now as she says I'm only 21 but I just don't feel as though I should be walking around with like a super kind of cropped um short top but uh yeah I don't know we'll see how this goes see what it looks like and um yeah I'm not sure I'm half and half on this kind of got it hoping it would look good and it would look cool but we'll have to see <laughs> and that was everything from my top shop sale top picks haul whatever i decide to call it i'm not sure yet i really hope you did enjoy this video make sure to let me know which is your favorite piece they're all so pretty but i do love these shirts they are just such great staples um so yeah i'll have to see what bits fit what bits look nice um fingers crossed they all do as always everything will be linked below and everything is also linked over on my blog um but yeah i really hope you did enjoy this video if you did please do give it a big thumbs up and i will see you in my next video which is hopefully going to be a review of loving tan if it arrives if not i will see you on sunday where i'm going to be styling these pieces up and trying them on so yes i will see you then i hope you all have a lovely week